Welcome and thank you for choosing Web Education Android Tutorials. My name is Chris and in today's video I'll be showing you how to turn off autocorrect in your Android device. Now, autocorrect is a feature on Android that replaces the words you're typing whether it's in a message or a chat or an email uh, using words that it has learned from other places in this phone or in your device and sometimes it might replace the words you want to send with the words you don't want to send and make some text or email uh, meaningless. So sometimes you feel like you want to turn off autocorrect on your Android device. How do you do it? Go to settings. On your settings page, look for language and input. You can find language and input under controls in Galaxy S3, for example. Select language and input. And from the language and input window, select the Samsung keyboard settings. Uh, when you see Samsung keyboard, select the settings cog icon that coincides with Samsung keyboard. Now right here there's a lot of settings that you can change for how you use a Samsung keyboard. Uh, the first option is predictive text. This is just a feature that will predict what you want to text and if you want to uh, use the prediction you can simply touch on it but that's not as harmful as auto replacement which is the second option. The second option auto replacement is the one that automatically replaces or automatically corrects what you're typing with what the phone thinks. Or the device things you should you ought to be typing so that's what you need to turn off auto replacement or auto correct uh, you can also turn off auto capitalization if you want or auto spacing or auto punctuate uh, if you like the procedure is the same for any other android device although the way to get there might be a little bit different but it's more or less the same uh, method so that's how you can change or turn off auto correct on your android device Thank you for watching. If you have any question or comment, leave it in the comments box below this video. And don't forget to subscribe. My name is Chris from Web Education.org.